Hello, nice to see you all. How wonderful is this? I gotta say, this whole movement is already afoot, and I'm a little bit late to it myself, so thank you for accepting me. But this is a big deal. Um, if any of you are out there that are considering joining the Garden Club, I would strongly recommend it, mainly because we are currently at a stage where everyone is waking up to what we, many of us here, already know. And so there's this opportunity to grasp this important moment where everyone is waking up to a certain kind of consciousness around native plants. Um, I would say this is not to be taken for granted. I worked for many years at HGTV, and HGTV is part of the machinery of the garden lawn care industrial complex. And as such, you've seen us do terrible things on TV. You've seen us lay out sod that comes in rolls. You've seen us, you've seen me spray Roundup. You know, there's my grinning face with a big bottle of, like, the, the backpack of Roundup. And I'm spraying it on camera as if, you know, this is the thing to do. Long story short, we are now part of a growing movement. And I am now inserting myself into this movement so let's not take it for granted and let's embrace this as our moment to let our neighbors know the kinds of things that we can all do to make a really big difference i'm going to get into this in my presentation but i, I just want to say this one thing as homeowners who own property with a small piece of land attached to your house you have this extremely interesting unique opportunity to make a difference in terms of an ecological footprint. It's very rare that one human being can have such an outsized influence on such an important thing. If you are lucky enough to own a piece of property on this earth, you are uniquely positioned to actually make a difference in the short amount of time that you're given on this earth. It's a very rare and unique opportunity. Oftentimes, these things are beyond our control. We don't have the opportunity to control such things as dis the destruction that we're wreaking on nature. But having one piece of property on this earth gives you an outsized amount of control. The one thing I've had said to me over and over again lately as I'm on this book tour about native plants is, you wouldn't believe how quickly the insects show up when I plant one plant that invites them in. You wouldn't believe how quickly the butterflies are in my backyard the day after I planted this one plant that they happen to love. What does that tell you? It tells you that these animals are desperate, that we have been too zealously taking over their natural environments without giving them any kind of ref uh, uh, um, uh, R.E. Replacement, thank you. Without giving them any kind of replacement. So as soon as we create a habitat for them, they show up. And for me, that says you have all the power that you could possibly want to actually make a difference in this world, which is a unique enough thing if you think about it.